What is up folks, it's time to do a review about this totally awesome game I've been really hyped up about, Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition for PlayStation 4. First up, let's talk about graphics. All in all folks, we know graphics matter and as it's 2017, people are already expecting hyper realistic graphics in or in the upcoming games, but Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition is totally remastered if you compare it to the original one. Imagine playing original Bulletstorm at 60 frames per second with awesome fully remastered graphics. Yeah, this is what Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition is. It's a stunning ultra high resolutions, updated with high resolution textures, increased polygon counts, sterling audio and smoother frame rates, all running in up to 4K resolution on PC and PS4 Pro of this new version of Bulletstorm. And trust me, they delivered it right, but when we notice frame drop and moving into new environments from checkpoints and some invisible walls, sticky environments, but all of them are easily ignorable once you get your hands on game, which was actually released six years ago. Time flies. Now let's talk about the gameplay. As we've already uploaded some in-game footages before the release here on the channel, we had idea that the game is going to be awesome in every aspect. And this is what happened when we played Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition on PlayStation 4. We experienced fun, easy gameplay, especially while shooting and sprinting around here and there are the leash that allows you to pull objects towards you. Gameplay of Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition on PS4 is what we mentioned before. Flawless, obviously. Now let's talk about the plot. Now, talking about the plot will be short because you know why we are not used to spoil main story of any game in any game review, but the thing is Bulletstorm Full Cup Edition is just a remastered edition with extra content, but the story is still the same as it was 6 years ago. Though you can play as Duke Nukem in Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition, I don't know why I went so excited, cause I love that guy. What if someone pre-ordered it, but story will be remained the same as it was back then. Now it's time for the conclusion. Yeah, 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 totally. We made the shortest review on the channel and this is one of them. The thing is, Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition is a remastered edition with lots of enhancement and graphics, but meanwhile the game campaign or game music is still the same, which is pretty obvious. It's a shame that there was not a huge amount of extras in Full Clip Edition to make returning Bulletstorm fans feel like they're getting something new, a handful of new challenge maps for its score-based echo mode and packaged add-ons from the original don't add much beyond what's already accessible. The only thing that actually is notable is a pre-order bonus that lets you play as Duke Nukem, a fun and awesome addition, but the characters still addresses the Duke Nukem by the name of Bulletstorm's protagonist Grayson, which is again a negative thing and a shame as well, big shame, biggest gripe for the game. To be honest, we really enjoyed the game though, lots and lots of fun to do like many things but mainly story, we know remastered usually are not up to date with graphics but Bulletstorm full competition is awesome in almost all aspects. Regardless of no story content which makes Bulletstorm full clip edition a little boring for those who already played the game in 2011. We can simply say that Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition is a badass remastered thing and that has secured 7.5 out of 10 for being a good remastered game only in game mechanics and graphics while leaving everything old as it is was back in time 6 years ago. And if you really want to buy the game, if you are a fan then go for it. If you are a newcomer, Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition then for sure get this game because you are new and you haven't played the old one so Full Clip Edition will not bother you for being old with new quotes. Anyways, do let us know in the comment section below, what are your thoughts on this review? Have you played? Will you buy it? If you liked our review, please like this video and subscribe to Games Boiler. Until we see you again, take care. Keep boiling.